looked online and found this cute little white and orange kitten named Sherbert and I was approved, my application was approved. I will be getting the cat and she said she's all good Thursday morning. So I will go pick him up Thursday morning. Cute. We leave very soon to get the new kitten. looked online and found this cute little white and orange kitten named Sherbert. It's about a month and a half old. It would have been born April 5th, so like the day before my surgery. And I don't know, life has been stressful lately. I feel like this could be a perfect little ball of distraction and sunshine that our family needs. So I went ahead and filled out an application and my cats are up to date on their vet appointments. I always have more love in my heart to give to more cats so and i hope that my application gets accepted and i get a call back and i'm able to meet this little kitten i actually shared in my last video making the fairy garden that i have wanted a white cat for years and wanted to name it coconut but when i came across this one named sherbert i was like that's honestly perfect like mango i have a mango i have a banana and i have a sherbert so like, what are your cat's name? Mango, banana, sherbet. They just sound so cute together. So, I don't know. I feel like it's a sign. I saw so many cats today during my outing. Felt like that was a sign. That's that. I'm gonna shuck some corn with my baby now. <laughs> hey, baby. You're making some shitty. I'm making some yucky. Mango was about an attack. And then just a third little chicken wing right here. You two have no idea what you're in for. I think you're gonna do fine. I think you're gonna be great. I hope you don't go pee pee everywhere. I hope you don't go pee pee everywhere. Sweet baby. Look at your face. So I have updates, El Chapo's. I got a call from where I'm adopting the kitten and I was approved, my application was approved and I will be getting the cat. I'm meeting him on Thursday. I am so excited to meet him. I was telling my therapist on the phone today, I was like, I was like my heart goes on and on and on for cats. Like I feel like I could own a billion and still like have more and more love for them. Children, I'm tapped out after this one. <laughs> and my cats have been extra lovey on me, probably because I keep going up to them and being like, you want a kitty, you want a kitty, and giving them love. They have no idea what I'm talking about, but in my head, I'm like, they're giving me extra love because they're like, you better not, mom. It's gonna be an adjustment period, obviously, but I think they're gonna be fine. Right, you're gonna be okay. Mango has had an on and off peeing problem since, 
Lila was born and brought home from the hospital, one day Mango just popped up on my bed and pissed. And it ended up being like an every few month cycle thing until I was able to figure out what's going on. It is not, it's been bad. I feel so bad for her. And I was told that this will likely be life long like whenever she gets stressed and inflamed and stuff like that so that's fun thinking about getting pet insurance you know how cats are you think they're low maintenance but they're high maintenance but you love them they're the best also i feel like this little kitten is gonna look so cute when he's a full-grown cat like oh my goodness <laughs> i am so excited this is what we're eating tonight my dad and stepmom made it and brought it over for me. Ooh, 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 yum, yum, yum. I'm excited. Goodbye. Right. So I got the playroom ready for the kitten to stay in while he is being dewormed and just getting used to the sounds and the smells of the house. And I will show what that looks like. I moved most of Lila's toys into her room and I actually really like the way it's set up. Of course, the kitties are amazed by the new room as well, so they're exploring, which is good. Let them get their scent all up in here. Need like a little recliner in here for it can sleep on the recliner. So far, I have a few cat things in here and I just Amazon a bunch of things and those will show up over the next few days. But yeah, I called and I scheduled him a vet appointment. That's all set up. And I got in touch with the person who I will be adopting him from. And she said she's all good Thursday morning. So I will go pick him up Thursday morning, meet him, make sure he's a good fit for sure. And yeah, I'm very excited. It's been a while since I've had a little kitten. Four years. That's a long time. I love kittens. I'm definitely a cat mom. Are you too excited to have a sibling? No. They'll get used to him. I'll insert some pictures. Banana was actually being pretty civil with the neighbor cat. I mentioned in my birthday video that I have a neighbor cat that comes literally like morning lunch and dinner and asks for food and Banana at first hated it. Mango chased it away. But now Banana like laid down next to it this morning. So that's progress. I go to pick the kitten up tomorrow. I just went to PetSmart, water fountain, and a kitten crate. I have three adult cat crates, but he's gonna be a little fart, and his little claws are gonna be boop, 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 all around. The cute. Oh, he's gonna like it. Some treats. This one's for kittens, and this one, adults. This is salmon and dairy. This is shrimpy shrimp. <laughs> shrimpy shrimp. But yeah, I was talking to the cashier woman. She was an old crazy cat lady. She was like, I love cats and kittens. I was like, me too. <laughs> She's like, my favorite cat of all time was so sweet. He was all orange. You're gonna love this kitty. I'm so excited for you. Gotta love crazy cat ladies. And if you're a cat boy, I love me a boy who loves cats. So I got these little ice creams. I mean, Sherbert ice cream, same category. I'm gonna stick them to the wall. I got the fountain figured out. Hey. See, like one right here, one a little bit higher. Can I pick our case? Yeah, and then you just unscrew it. Can I do the few? Yeah. Oh, okay, I can do the few. How long am I gonna be unscrewing for? Underneath is catnip. Yes. The feather. You can leave it in this room for the kitty and maybe he will play with it. Okay, I'll try that. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> so I saw my sister Amy today for the first time in like seven years, six years. Yeah, six years, because she was a kitten. My dad was like, watch you not see Lila now for another seven years, because this was her first time actually meeting Lila. I was like, wow, seven years from now, Lila will be almost 10. So that is crazy, but it's not unlikely, because Amy is a very busy bee. 
it's just time flies and even though that's not like a huge amount of time so much happens in that chunk of time lila's gonna be a completely different little girl mango is gonna be she'd be 13. i love my miss mango girl i love you so much i hope you like the new kitten Yo, chunky baby chunky baby you come on off and wash your hands oh i'm so proud of her i just come in from talking to my cat and my baby's gone body all on her own. They grow up so fast. I'm so proud of you. Good job. All right, let's do your sticker chart real quick. I'll do it. Right there. Okay. Yep. Ta-da, high five. I'm proud of you, baby. Do that all on your own. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> I'm getting her used to this room. Her smells in here. And that way she doesn't feel left out. Like, you can play with these toys too, kitty. Her birthday's on Friday. She's turning six years old. It's hard to believe. I actually watched her birth. I talk about this all the time. I watched her pop out of her mom. Best day of my life, probably. Up there with the day that Lila was born. Her little tail, like she's so long. You're so cute. <laughs> Hi. Hi, Cozy. You look cute there. Just think about how much you love Banana. You have a new friend. I don't even worry about his dingus ass. Look at him. He's playing so much like a little kitten. He needs a kitten to play with. I'm excited to see him with the kitten. I feel like it won't be long <laughs> before they're playing. I'm probably gonna introduce them first. We leave very soon to get the new kitten. Yeah, when we get home, you'll cut him lots. Have you found the toy? Yes, you did. We have a mango and a banana at home, and you're gonna be so happy. You did, you're the baby. You're the baby. We love you so much. You're already so loved. You need to take a little nap. You have anxiety. It's okay. Sometimes we get nervous. Being nervous is normal. So we got Sherbert, he's in here. <laughs> come on, come here. I think we want to get out. He's purring, he's sleepy. How do you leave this clothes? Mommy, I said to leave this clothes. Mm -hmm. We got Sherbert and then Mommy's and Take a picture. <laughs> See, Joy. Hey, little kitten. Yeah, can I pick her? Don't you love little cats? Mm. Kittens? Yeah, I know. Are you going to play with him a lot? Yeah. The Sherbert is much fun. Can I hold Sherbert? Sherbert is so much fun. Um, If he wants to be held, he would walk right over to you. But right now, he's looking around at other people. And he's looking around at the parking lot. So excited! His little feeties. Yeah. I think of lunch time. He's like, what is this? It smells funny. It smells like my sibling. So this is Sherbert. <laughs> <laughs> Letting him explore my car a little bit. I got a kitten, and I'm dressed for the occasion. Hi. Oh. <laughs> you giving me a hug. Yeah, he gave you 
lots of love. Hey, hug her and kiss. She's face. Oh. He is. Is he purring? He is purring. Oh, I think. Hello, new dude. <laughs> Hello, new dude. He's sleeping. Can oh, I take a he's picture? kneading. He's kneading on the bed. That's what cats do when they are reminded of their mommy. Oh, I think he's happy. Okay, let's let him sleep. Hi, little guy. Hey, he sees through the mirror. So we got the new kitten. Mango is. She's like seen the kitten and looked around the edge and then running. She's out in the garage. She's, other than that, acting normal, following me around, taking treats, taking love and attention. Banana, on the other hand, slept through the entire time that I brought him home. And I don't even think he knows that there's a kitty in here. He probably just smells the cat and he left. He went outside to wander the neighborhood. The kitten is taking its second nap, but he is so sweet. He's already rubbing against Lila and me, like, yep, these are my mommies. <laughs> so, he's adjusting well. And I always feel so bad during the early stages, because, like, I just took him from his brothers and sisters, and they were all playing and having fun together and laying together and snuggling, and now he's by himself in a room, and I'm just... <sighs> it, it hurts my heart until they get adjusted and forget about all that. I just always feel so bad, but... He's well loved and he's in a good, safe home. So yeah, whenever I start introductions, I'll have that baby gate up and Mango and him will be able to look through it at each other. And there's Mango. Looking cute as ever, yeah. Go. Like, as long as he doesn't touch my food, I'm fine. Where are you going? 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 Don't go under there. I have backup for Mango. She's definitely scared of you. Now she's, look, she's looking to her left and her right. Like, what? Toddler on my right, kitten on my left. I'm surprised she's not releasing all her bowels. Does <laughs> that smell like mango right there? He has that open mouth look when he smells something. <laughs> You're so cute. 
Like y'all share with he grilled me Oh, you're doing great. It's okay. It's okay. You're doing great. expecting these two to do so good together. Especially this fast. <laughs> He's gonna get your tail. He's gonna get your tail. He's gonna get your tail. He's so cute. Look how big he is. Can we climb on down? <laughs> oh. I'm gonna give some updates on little man. Mango is doing great with him. She's nose booping him. She's hissed and growled a few times, but overall she's just like, yay, another cat with more food in the house for me to steal. So she is doing good with little man. Banana, and she's also, she's the one that pees outside the litter box whenever she gets stressed. So I am very, very proud of her. She hasn't done that at all. Banana, on the other hand, he is so much more territorial than I thought he would be, and it's weird because he's an outdoor cat. He spends the least amount of time here, and when he comes in, it's like nighttime or just to get food and water, and then he leaves again, yet he acts like he owns the place. He is so upset that there's another male cat in the house, and I don't know if it's because Sherbert still has his nuts intact or why, but he, Banana, has been hissing and growling and hiding and he even he's been acting aggressive towards mango and even me at one point i have feliway plugged in everywhere he has a calming collar on i'm just taking it slow keeping them separated and showing banana as much love as i can reminding him he is still king of the household yeah he is my playful one like he is the one that he would just follow mango around everywhere when he was a kitten and they attached immediately to each other I thought that would be the same with this little dude, that he'd follow Banana around everywhere and Banana would have another little friend to play with. But Banana has no interest. He's like, just get out of my house. This is my house. <laughs> so poor little boy. You are so loved, though, by all your humans. It will be okay. You are just the cutest, Sherbert. Just take a second and look at his cute little face. Hehehehe. <laughs> There's just something about cats. There's not enough time in the day for how much love I want to give to my cats. I could spend all day long with them every day and be happy. All right, say goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> Who is that? Who is that? I just want to show real quick this really cute sweatshirt I got. Looks just like my kitties. First time he saw it, he was like putting his paws on them. So cute. I hope you enjoyed my journey of getting a new kitten. It will be quite a journey of getting Banana to like him, but he'll come around eventually.